Hey y'all, what's up? Welcome back. If you are new to the channel, welcome to the channel. My name is Helen and today I am sharing my gift giving guide for the holiday season of 2023. So this is going to be a fun one. I decided to do things a little bit different this year. Instead of going around the house, grabbing items and just sharing everything with you all that I already have, there's a few items that I want as well on my wish list. A few items I think that goes perfect with these categories I came up with, okay? That you might like for yourself or for someone else. And I decided just to break them down in categories and share them with you. A lot of these items are on Amazon. Some of these are direct links that maybe I am affiliate with. If you're interested in seeing what I want to share with you all today for my holiday gift giving idea, stay tuned. All right, so let's get into the first gift giving idea and we're gonna put it here and it's gonna be glassware. And this is for the entertainer. So there's a lot of people out there who love to entertain. And most of the people who do entertain normally have the bulk of the items they already want or need when it comes to like wine bottle openers or corks, those little cute corks with the little sparklings on them. Most of the time people already have that stuff. However, you can find those items at like Marshalls, Home Goods right now for really good prices. But for those who like specific glassware and you know they entertain a lot, it's kind of expensive over time to collect large amounts of glassware, especially stemware. So I went ahead and put a gift giving idea right here for you all to um, click the link down below if you want to add that to someone's uh, like collection. Now, the reason why I say Amazon for me is the perfect place to buy these type of items is because nine times out of 10, I'm shipping these items. I'm gifting these items to people who do not live close to me. So I feel safer just ordering from Amazon and let Amazon do their delivery. And nine times out of 10, they'll get it within two days. And I don't have to worry about anything breaking, me packing up shipping, going to the post office or anything like that. This is why I personally like shopping for Amazon. I like to go through and see the different stores read the reviews on the products as well and then see you know what people are saying about these products now let's go ahead and get to the stemware I'm not gonna go through each one but I do have listed the white uh, white wine red wine martini glasses as well as some cocktail glasses that I think would be cute for like cognac glasses and the different size glasses. So I often get asked the question, what size are my glasses with a long stem? I actually have them linked down below. So you can go ahead and click and see the actual glasses I have. I have just about every one of these that is on this list, except for like the cute little glasses with the gold rim, but it's on my wish list. But I think this is perfect for the lover who, uh, for the person who likes to entertain, drinks wine, and you know that they can use a good set of glasses, okay? I also put a few fun glasses in there that I've seen people use like on TikTok and Instagram for um, for aesthetic reasons. Just really cute, simple, like, you know, fun glasses. I put a few there so you can go ahead and check them out. I did not add the glasses that are very popular right now with the rigid lines on them because they're at Crate and Barrel and a couple of those you can find at Ross right now. So if you're looking for someone else, this is a perfect option, especially shopping on Amazon. If you're looking for yourself and you don't mind going out in stores with all the people, honey, and standing in line, go right ahead. You can probably find some of these glasses at Home Goods for sure, as well as TJ Maxx. The next one is going to be for the gardener. This is for the hydroponic gardener or for maybe the person who wants to get into hydroponics. If you're living in the like, colder climates, right now you're probably not able to grow outside successfully and so you want to be able to bring it indoors. So I want to share with you all the garden as well as the click and grow. I think these two units are very good units. I believe right now they both are running anywhere between uh, 20 to 35% off on their units. This is the time to get them. Black Friday will be a really amazing deal on both of these items. I'm just telling you, okay? I'm going to post it on short form for sure in a short, and I will post it in the community tab. So if you're interested in any one of these items, go ahead and make sure you follow me on my link tree and make sure you are following me on all. So underneath the subscribe button, you will go ahead and click all so you'll be notified each and every time I do an upload or post in the community tab. Now, when it comes to the click and grow Monday, Cyber Monday, there will be a sale. For the Guardian, they've already started their sale. I don't know if they're going to push an extra percentage off or not. I haven't been told, but I know the Click and Grow will. So go ahead and check them out. They're both good units. They both have amazing Facebook uh, groups. So if you just want to 
go ahead and scroll and try to figure out like is this for me or not or which one is for me check it out i also have videos on my channel on both of them and a ton of shorts because we eat off of it all day every day all right so i think both of these would be amazing for that special someone who likes to grow outdoors like year round like me who can i would suggest getting the green stock grow tower i'm not sure if they're going to put it on sale on their particular site i just linked the one from amazon because it's easy and it's always in my link tree but the actual website <clears throat> sorry the actual the actual website for green stock um, normally does the sale for Black Friday, Cyber Monday. I would say it's as good, if not better, than the sale they do for Mother's Day. And Mother's Day sale is always off the chain, okay? So if you've been wanting to grow in those towers, and you see I grow in those towers year-round. I love my towers. I'm obsessed with my towers. I now have five towers total, and there's two more I plan on getting. So hopefully I can get one for Black Friday myself. I would definitely suggest it. So this board right here is for the growers, okay? For the ones who want to grow indoors, outdoor, but love container growing, all right? Let's keep it moving. I would say this is my favorite category out of all these categories. However, juicing is a, mm, real close to it. I'm a coffee lover. There's a lot of coffee lovers out there. I am in so many coffee groups. It is so fun to see all these amazing cocktails and mocktails and special coffees that they make all the time. But I'm going to tell you, my favorite group is the Nespresso group, okay? So on my list, I actually have the Nespresso, um, the machine that actually comes with the frother. Right now, you will see that on sale everywhere. Everywhere from Kohl's to Amazon to the actual website themselves. The one thing about the website, when you buy this, you will receive like the package, the extra package with the sample coffees with it, as well as the one on Amazon. I actually linked the first machine that uh, was gifted to me about five years ago. That machine I have worn, okay, and used daily. I actually gifted that machine to Garrick and he's still using it. So that machine is going on past five years. I did not click i did not link the keurig or mention the keurig because i ran through four keurigs in like i would say two years as i've had the nespresso machine for years and it's still going strong okay so much so i purchased a second machine and that was the one from my study upstairs that's the one i'm currently using the virtual machine that's the one with the larger pods the one thing about the nespresso virtual machines you have the option of having espresso which is a shot like 1.5 ounce from having um, a normal size coffee, which is about 7.7 .7 ounces, 7.7, .7, something like that. And then you have the, like, which I would call the Venti. Um, and I want to say that's like 11 or something like that for the large one. You also have options for iced coffee. And each one of the coffees, when you go on the website or if you go on Amazon to buy the coffee, or if you see it in store, it will have a line in the back that will show you from mild, like the mildest, like, not as strong flavor, all the way up to the strongest and boldest, okay? So make sure you check that out. Now, I suggest if you're getting into Nespresso, you don't want to spend as much money on that, go ahead and start with the older machine, the original machine. I plan on getting another original machine myself. I actually got the dupe from Aldi last year, right? Was it Aldi at the beginning of the year? It was like $19, y'all. So I'm able to find these small pots very cheap in like bulk, at home goods normally like $3.99 to $5.99 a pack and that's for 10 coffees so that's less than a dollar per coffee if you get the virtual machine with the larger pods you're going to spend anywhere from a dollar 19 to about a dollar 45 a coffee which is still winning friend still winning and i'm talking about good coffee okay <laughs> strong bold coffee all right so those are the two coffee machines I wanted to mention. Now, the actual frother, I have the Maestri House frother. I actually have two Maestri House frothers. I am obsessed with it. You can do cold foam or just a cold like spin where it just kind of frothes a little bit or actual thick froth of cold foam. You can do hot foam or you can just heat up your milk, your nut milk, your creamers or whatever. I love this thing and it's large in size. So if you want to make enough for several people you're not making one individual at in, uh, each time you can just make enough for several coffees so yeah i have the mainstream house brand i have had i've had two sent to me i purchased one as a gift and i think this is the perfect gift and it has lasted me the first one over two years and i basically use it 
I was I would say every day, but I've slacked off for coffee a little bit. So I would say for three to four days a week. I also added a few glassware. I think a lot of people always ask me about my cute little glass. They're short and they're I use them for coffee or tea and it has the etching on it. It's so beautiful. It reminds me of like classic vintage glassware. I went ahead and linked those for you all and it comes with two gold like stir spoons as well. Now the warmer. I have the white warmer, the one I'm going to show you here. It's also linked down below. I am, I will be purchasing the black one because it'll go on my desk when my desk comes. But the warmer for me is for cups such as like these. So when I'm drinking coffee out of cups like these, I just sit them on a warmer and it actually keeps my coffee warm. So yeah, I like that for myself. Listen, I can never have too many warmers, whether you're at work or whether you're at home. Everybody needs a coffee warmer if you're a coffee lover. It's nothing like having to keep getting up and warming your coffee up in the microwave. I want to say I saw this before and thought it was a travel mug for Nespresso, like something you just put your coffee in and travel with you. I didn't realize that this is actually a travel coffee maker that you can put this small original Nespresso pod in, add your hot water, take it with you, and when you're ready, you press this button and it will dispel the coffee. Um, the water through the coffee and create your coffee. You, and it would be an espresso size coffee. Ordering it. I am ordering this. Hopefully on Cyber Monday. It'll be cheaper than what it is today. I found one that was $47 that I'm obsessed with. They have other ones that go up into like about $125. Depends on how fancy you are. I'm not that fancy. I want this one right here. She's getting this one right here. This on my wish list right here. All right. And when I get it, I'll share. So I'm obsessed with this. And if you know someone who loves Nespresso, who, um, I don't, I don't even know when I'm going to use it. It could be like I'm in these streets and I just want a coffee and I'm not pulling over to get one. I have my hot water in this container. It's going to keep the hot water hot. And all I do is press the button and bam, there it is. I'm just saying. <laughs> I should not love coffee this much, but I do. All right, so for the coffee lover or for you yourself, here is my gift-giving idea for the Nespresso and all things that come with it and you know, on the side of it that you need. Mm. It's like right now, juicing is very popular. Everybody's wanting to juice. So many companies are coming up with machines that look like machines or just duping machines. And in reality, a lot of these machines that are like, you know, $100, and under, they really cannot handle the power that certain machines can handle, such as Nama. And I'm going to throw Cubans in there. Even though I don't have the machine, I know other people who talk about the machine that are influencers that I'm really good friends with. They love their machine just like I love my machine. They're both about the same price. The thing about it is I know more about Nama, so all I can talk and you know is about Nama. So when it comes to Nama, I'm obsessed with Nama for the simple fact that they have a nice size hopper where you can dump all your ingredients in for your one or two um, people juice or whatever person's shoes create your juice and it's a 15 year warranty i don't have to chop up a bunch of fruits and vegetables i just have to toss them in there and let it go go do whatever else i need to do come back flip it open let it come out and my juice is ready like it's so simple it's easy to clean it has very nice like dry pulp some of the pulp is still a little bit wet because it is a juicer but for the most part it's not pulp i can rejuice or squeeze out i know the juicer is up in price there will be a black friday sale starting black friday i will announce it on short form as well as long form here and i will put in a community tab i was i should be able to share a gift code with you all hopefully friday morning okay i'm just waiting because baby it's about to be on so if you're like me and you make juices plus you make smoothies or you're plant-based vegan whatever right and you like to create sauces and smoothies or you like to make sorbets the c2 is for you the c2 is going to have your hopper for your juicer as well as your blender head so you got both options and they're both going to be on sale <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm just saying, you might want to come back and stay tuned. So if you're interested in juicing and you thought that the juicer was a little bit pricey, there will be a discount coming up for Black Friday. And the one thing I like about NAMA is that they offer like these payments. So if you qualify for like, I want to say PayPal, Affirm, like 
those type of companies, you should be able to break your payments up in like four or five. I'm not sure what it is, but make sure you check it out. It is linked down in my link tree. I link it for every video that I do because I just want to encourage everybody to juice. That's the one thing I like about the company. They're not big on pushing like buy this, buy this. If anything, if you go to the website, you'll see they have classes available and their nutrition is, she's bomb. I've talked to her several times and I'm obsessed with just her mind and how it works. And she's so smart that you can also email them with questions. They have a lot of juicing books, recipes for smoothies, as well as sorbets, as well as mocktails, which I just shared with you all. We just did a huge mocktail um, influencer fun, like interactive and on point. On point. I also link a few of these funnels. I use these funnels when pouring these juices in like my smaller top jars, like my um, shot jars, so they don't waste the juice. But y'all seen me waste the juice enough. But y'all know, y'all seen these funnels. I also link the two ounce shot jars that we use for our turmeric shots or our ginger and orange juice or ginger and pineapple shots, which is our wellness shots. And so around this time of year, come fall, soon as fall hits, we are on the wellness shots so that we don't get. <laughs> All those things is out there, okay? Boost our immune system, work on the gut health, all right? Now, when it comes to the larger juice jars with the tops, I link the ones that have the tops without the holes and the top with the holes and include the straws. That way, if you want to take it on the go, you can just pop your straw in the top and the lid. Or if you want to juice and save the juice in your refrigerator, which is another reason why I like Nama, a lot of these juices, you can save three to five days. They will hold the nutrients in it because of the type of juice it is, it is and it doesn't heat up your food so you don't lose nutrients as you juice. So... Yeah, definitely love these jars. I use them in almost every video. If you're looking for the ball jars, just go to your local grocery store or go to like Walmart and I would say Walmart. They even have their own brand, which is a Kerr. I think it's K-E-R-R. -R. And check them out if you want ball jars. That's my juice and gift guide. I don't know if you want to buy this for somebody. They must be really special. But if you, ma'am, sir, going into the new year, want to change your life, I'm just saying, want to change for the better when it comes to wellness, health, gut health, fitness, energy, when it comes to just putting all things good and great in your body, fruits and vegetables, get you a juicer, okay? Now, get whatever one you can afford. I'm just recommending the Nama because it's what I've been using and I'm obsessed with it. I use it every day. All right. All right, they have accessories on the site, too, that goes with the juicer. I'm actually expecting a strainer to come today to try it out and see how I feel about it. But I don't feel I even need a strainer because I feel like the juicer does so well without it. But we're going to test that out. All right. This is for the person you know maybe works from home. Maybe they just need to chill out and relax sometime. They just need a break. And you want to add to, like, their rest and relaxation, their Sunday reset their self-care Saturday, Sunday, get them a robe. Let me tell y'all, y'all see me. I've been on this channel for years and every year I purchase two robes from Amazon and it's normally a long like silk robe like this in different colors or I get the one with the hoodie. I love the one with the hoodie. I wear them so much. I end up tearing up the pockets from washing them in the washing machine. Everyone in my house has this one with the hoodie. We all have different colors, including Christopher. I love these. So you can get this for men or women, especially when it's cold like this in the morning and you just want to walk around with your robe on and feel like, you know, there's no walk around with hoodies and jackets and blankets around you. We don't do that here. Everybody has a robe and it's comfortable and we love them and they're affordable. Right now on Black Friday, the men's robes with the hoodies are around $22. They come in solid colors as well as colors with the inner lining like that matches. Like here I put blue and green. I love that color. I might get another one for Christopher. And then for the women, I have that. It looked like pink or something. And then I have the green one. But it's more like nude. I don't know how to describe it. But I love it. All right. And it's just, I just love them. They're just comfortable. And of course, I have this one right here, which is the animal print one. But I have it in short form. So I love robes. I just, I've always loved robes. I just think they just add to the... I don't know, the comfort and the, the chill of it all. All right, you're just chilling with your robe. Now, one thing that is out that everybody's talking about is these Ugg slippers, okay? Ugg slippers and the indoor slippers for Crocs. So I tried to find something that was similar 
that went in reading like the comments because they're just indoors. I mean, who's going to see these unless you're taking them outside? But we don't take our, uh, inside shoes out. I would never. These are shoes we will wear inside and they look so good. So I plan on ordering a pair from at least two different companies to review them myself. So I do not have these. However, I did go through and read the comments and I saw a few pictures and I saw a couple other influencers review these to compare them because their pricing is less than half the price of buying the other brands okay so we want to find some that's affordable so we can get more okay get your robe and some slippers for the price of one pair of slippers i'm just saying all right so these slippers right here at the bottom these pink slippers i have these y'all know about these every year we go through them we wash them so we end up tearing them up like every like it's like five or six months they're nine dollars most of the time no more than 11.99 so everybody has these me and uh me and my girls for christopher we just normally get the man slippers we pick up at like ross or marshall's and the ones he got last year i think were kohan that i found at tj maxx girl they was cheap okay don't forget burlington too when it comes to robes and slippers so if you're looking for someone that's in like your you know area that you're actually going to take a gift to make sure you check out burlington as well as Ross. I'm just not trying to go to the stores this year. I'm trying to shop online. All right. So the next one is for the plant lover. Someone like me. All right. If you love plants, this might be for you as well. But if you know someone who loves plants, I just put a few things here that I thought would be pretty cool. Because most people who like plants like to repot plants, propagate plants, like really cute, unique uh, vessels for plants. So I thought these would be good ideas for like planters for like a desk or maybe a counter in the kitchen just really cute propagating like vessels and then i also picked out a mat that i think would be pretty neat i always put out a trash bag and i always cut it open and <laughs> repop my plants or a trash bag but i'm getting one of these i just gotta figure out what color i want this is so cute they're nine bucks and you can open them up and they have like this little like lip on the side so that your dirt doesn't get all over your floor i always end up having to vacuum up dirt and then mop I'm getting one of these. I can't believe I'm gonna have one of these. So there's people out there who actually like certain items in some of these categories that don't have it all. Trust me, y'all think I have it all. People always ask me when I clean like my fiddle fig leaves here, the one upstairs. Um, people always ask me, what am I using the spray that's on my leaves? I'll tell you, I'll get it from H-E-B. It's cheaper for me to get it from H-E-B, like nine or 10 bucks, but they do have these sprays on Amazon and it is a leaf shine spray. And for me, once I wash my leaves, I put a little bit of Dawn and a big thing of water, I clean my leaves and I like to spray them and it keeps that dust off my leaves. So I like it. I've never had a plant to, to like die from it. Definitely read about it and see for yourself. But I love the leaf shine. If you ever go to any of these office buildings, like doctor's office or like just your downtown buildings, you will see the leaves are always shiny and sparkling. Just really like almost look artificial. Nine times out of ten, they're using one of these leaf sprays. So I went ahead and linked one for you all. Check it out and let me know what you think. If you have a better like spray that you think is better, please put it down in the pinned comments. So we'll go back and look up okay i also put some watering cans so you can never have enough watering cans <laughs> especially if someone has plants like upstairs downstairs plants outside we always need watering cans so i put a really cute copper one that's actually on black friday sale right now as well as a more plastic heavier hardier one and the one that i linked where the plastic one actually has the heads you can switch out so if you want the little spout or the uh, shower light spout I definitely have, they definitely come with both of those. So definitely check them out. And I also link the toolkit. Now there's another toolkit. This is a simple toolkit. Definitely find these toolkits like at Target and Walmart, or whatever. Just that like right now, none of that stuff is out. All that stuff that would normally be in those sections are just like put away for right now. Because right now what's in season is Christmas trees and all things Christmas decor, right? So it's just easier to shop online when you're looking for certain items like this. And girl, I forever am losing gloves and tools. Like it never fails. I can never get enough tools when it comes to gardening. And whatever I use outdoors is for outdoors. And my indoor stuff stay indoors. I do not transfer tools or equipment from out to inside all right so definitely check that link out everything's down below so that is it for my gift giving idea let me know what you think about it did i do good if there's any other categories you would like for me to share my ideas on add some links and some suggestions maybe some items i've already tried 
definitely hit me up and I'll see if I can get that out for part two. And that will probably be after the 1st of December so we can get straight into like the gift giving um, ideas and guides. And that could be anything from skincare to like some fitness equipment. But I can say this, when it comes to anything that I purchase, most of my items are already linked in my Amazon store. For every video that I upload, I always make sure the Amazon links are down below, like fitness equipment for sure, because people always ask me about the treadmill. I don't know why, but I've had that treadmill for a couple years. I actually found it on a deal on Amazon, the big one, and I was able to make, I think it was five payments through a firm. Yeah, perfect. If you can't buy it all now, girl, just... Put that stuff on Afterpay or um, what you call it, PayPal and four, where there's no interest. Try to make sure there's no interest though. But that one I had to actually put on the firm. So it was a little interest added to it, but I wanted it immediately. Now the one that they sent out to me, that treadmill, the kids use that all the time. I don't know why, I think it's because it's smaller or whatever, but they like that treadmill. And um, yeah, when it comes to like fitness equipment or even the bikes or anything like that, the electric bikes, I try to make sure all that is always linked down below. And if it's not, it's in my link tree. You can always go to my link tree and you'll see my face pop up. And the first thing you'll probably see is Nama. You'll probably see Liquid IV because Liquid IV has a huge sale going on right now. I just placed the order yesterday, but you'll see all the things listed, including my other channels as well as my instagram and tiktok so i hope you enjoyed this video i hope this helped you out in gift giving ideas or if you're just looking for something for yourself it's just your friend you're shopping for you you want to create your wish list because now is the time to create your wish list so when people call you and say hey what do you want hey what do your kids want for the, uh, christmas this year all you have to do is go to your amazon click your list and hit share and you share that list you don't have to say, oh, well, I don't know. Well, you know, I really don't need nothing. Yes, you do. You know what you want because you created your list. And then you can just send that list out. They can go through that list and choose to purchase or not. It's the same list as I did for my spring um, wish list for the garden. Just like that. So if you've ever purchased anything and gifted it to my family, we still appreciate you, friend. We love you. Trust me. Still feel some type of way. I still be looking at stuff outside like, I can't believe somebody sent this to me. It's the same thing. It's just like opening up a registry at like Target or Walmart for weddings or babies, except it's a gift giving idea so that you make sure that the gift you're receiving is something you actually want. We don't want to waste anybody's money. And I know if you have children, you get this all the time. What do the kids want for Christmas? Let them go on Amazon, make them let them create their list, and then put their name with their list. You can keep it private where the only person who will see it is you and whoever you share with. Or you can have it open where others can shop off and send it to you okay but anyway thank you for hanging out with me today i just wanted to get this video up as early as possible i will see you all on the next video once again happy thanksgiving so a few tips from me to you stay safe make sure your car is gassed up so we don't have to stop for gas okay make sure we're in before dark okay and if especially if you're single Make sure you're in before dark. Make sure you're not carrying around a big tote bag or handbag. All you need is a little wallet or your debit card and your ID right here. That's all you need. And your phone. We don't want to be out there and we don't want to be targeted for nothing. Make sure you're aware of your surroundings. Keep your kids close. <laughs> your money closer. Okay, and I will see you on the next video. Peace and blessings.